Hey there, my name is Dylan Gaskin. Thank you for joining me today to talk about my postmortem for my solo game demo for an RPG. This is a small project that I made at Full Cell shortly before Capstone. So let's start with the overview. The goal of the solo game demo was to showcase my skills and creativity as a game developer. Originally, I wanted to create a fully fledged RPG experience, complete with intricate systems and expensive gameplay. Unfortunately, due to the time constraints and the limited scale of the project, I had to narrow down my focus and create a more manageable demo within the allotted time frame. Let's start with the development process. I guess it can be broken down into three or four key phases. The first being conceptualization. As I stated before, I started with the ambitious goal of creating a full RPG experience. However, I quickly realized the need to scale back and focus on the key elements that could be feasibly implemented within a limited time frame. During the prototyping phase, I began prototyping various gameplay mechanics and features, experimenting with different ideas to determine what would work best for the scaled down version of the project. After that was production. With this new, more focused and narrow scope, I entered the production phase. Focusing on implementing core features such as the dialogue system, bootable chest, and dynamic NPCs. Then as the deadline approached, I shifted my focus to polishing the demo, refining gameplay mechanics, and addressing any remaining bugs or issues. And of course, throughout the development process, I encountered quite a few challenges. The main one being my time constraint. The project was just spending a few weeks, as at full sale, classes only last a month if you're in the expedited program. This presented a significant challenge. I had to make tough decisions about which features to prioritize and how to best utilize my time to achieve the desired outcome. And there's also the scope limitations. The enforced small scale of this project meant that I had to scale back my ambitions and focus on creating a demo that showcased key aspects of the gameplay experience while still being achievable within the given time frame. However, despite the challenges, there were also several successes throughout the project. While I initially aimed for a fully fledged RPG, I'm pretty proud of the focused gameplay experience I was able to create. The demo effectively showcases key mechanics such as the in-depth dialogue system, the lootable chest, and the dynamic NPC interactions. In the process of scoping it down, I also gained valuable experience and insights that will inform my future work as a game developer. Now, reflecting on this project, there are a few key lessons I've learned. I've gained a deeper understanding of the importance of effective scope management in game development. Learning to prioritize features and make tough decisions about what to include is crucial for success, especially in projects with tight time constraints. The need to adapt and be flexible in the face of this challenge is a key lesson I'll carry forward. While I initially had grand ambitions for the project, I learned to be realistic about what could be achieved, and I adjusted my goals accordingly. In conclusion, the solo game demo project has been a valuable learning experience for me. While I initially set out to create an awesome RPG with fully fledged quest lines and such, I'm proud of the more focused demo as I would have produced within the constraints of the project. I feel like I've grown as a game developer and gained valuable insights that will inform my future work. Thank you for taking the time to listen to this. I hope you enjoyed.